In this video, I'm going to show you how to take your live photos, which you've taken on your 6S or 6S Plus, and convert them into GIFs or into movie files. Now, for those who don't know, live photos is where you take an ordinary picture on your phone, but it records a second and a half before and a second and a half after. And then by using force touch on your phone, you're able to display the photo a bit like a really short GIF or a short movie. The trouble is you can't share the photos that you've taken unless the other person you want to share it with has the iPhone 6S or 6S Plus. So this provides a really good way of taking your live photos and making them shareable. So to do this, you need one of two apps from the App Store. The first one we'll look at is Live GIF. That costs $149 in the UK or $199 in the US. And it works really simply. We're just going to open up the app. So once you've opened the app, you select an image you liked and it will start creating the GIF for you. Now I've just taken a picture of a lamp in my room. Um, sort of spins around, has water in it. Um, just to show you how this works. So that's it. That's your GIF right there. You've got two options at the bottom. You can either share as a GIF or share as a video. And the sharing options come straight away like that. And you can do either. The next app I want to show you is called Lively. It's technically free on the App Store. Basically to try it out. You can use it three times before you have to use an in-app purchase to buy an unlimited amount of conversions. This has a little bit more advanced functionality and a few more settings to play with. So once you open it up, once again, you choose your image and it's a lot quicker actually in creating the GIF I've found. Now there's two options. You can see these at the top this time. The first one is movie or we can select GIF. Now at the bottom, you can see a settings button. Now this actually gives us, it seems to give us a few more options than live GIF currently does. Now you can play this backwards doesn't make much difference for this picture. Uh, or you can do auto reverse, which means it will play the live photo forwards and then backwards, which looks pretty good if you've got, I don't know, someone on a swing or something that moves backwards and forwards that look quite good as a GIF. So I'm going to turn that on. And it seems a little bit smoother now. And there's a couple more options. You can change the speed of it so we can make it really quite slow. Or we can speed it up really quickly. pretty cool and then you can change the size of the image you can make it slightly small if you want to save space big size is about 4.5 meg as you can see here and that's it there's your settings and then from there you can just export as a gif and as you can see i haven't bought the in-app purchase yet it will allow you three exports before you have to do in-app purchase it's about the same price as um, live gif but it seems to have a few more options currently now both of these apps use Force touch from the home screen so you can quickly choose the last live photo that you've done and turn it into a GIF, which you know is another added bonus. So there we are, that's how you convert your live photos taken on the iPhone 6S or 6S Plus and change them into a GIF or a movie file for sharing with others. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll be back soon with another video.